What's going on everyone? What is happening in the crypto markets? I haven't been talking about crypto for a little bit now, but I figured I'd drop my two cents so that you guys can uh, yeah, get up to date on what I'm doing. So I actually wrote a article on May 10th uh, this year saying this bull run seems dif different. And that was right pretty much at the top, uh, right here at 69,000, nice. Um, and so I was like, you know what, this, this, this crypto market seems a little bit different. I think I'm going to stay out of it. And so I, I've been selling all my crypto from, uh, just from projects and all sorts of stuff. And so right here, I said, I spent over 66,000 buying up different crypto in the 2021 bull run and I made a lot of money. Let's just put it that way. And, um, all the money I've been creating content usually is paid in USDT and I transfer straight to fiat to my bank. And so uh, this was when I beat the 21, the 2021 market. And it seems like I'm beating the 2024 market too. Um, because I have been literally selling all the way through here. Uh, pretty much. Yeah. I mean, pretty much all through here for like the last from March to January or till June or July or August, I guess now it's August. And I didn't hit this uh, massive dump episode because I've been cashing out, but I will be probably buying up some, I, I feel like it's still, there's still blood in the water. Um, I, I mean, if, if they can drop it down like to 49,000, I think that would be a good target, but we'll see. So it just seemed like this is the, my article. I said, even with all this into institution money, I feel like they are doing it to set up positions to get ready to short the market hard. Um, resetting the whole crypto market, wiping out all the meme coins and so pretty much again, beating the market like I do all the time. Uh, I think this is a hidden war now in big money. And for that reason, I'm out, uh, my plan for the crypto market, hundred percent backing on myself, banking on myself. Um, this was when I was in Joystream uh, a while ago, was doing great. And then uh, I realized that Joystream uh, is a bunch of scammers. So I uh, exited that whole thing and didn't want any ties with them because they're just dumping on everyone. But uh, I've been just paying off um, all my cars and uh, you know, just funneling money into land, my cars and uh, you know, real estate. So. I literally just been cashing out all of my USDT um, from you know, different programs. And so, um, like I said, I mean, I could, I could see this definitely bouncing back, but I could, def I mean, it's either or, right? It's either bouncing back or it doesn't. And it goes even further. I could see it going this, let me bring you guys in close. If I was a big money and I wanted to create maximum pain, I would have been accumulating to drive people up and then shorting the market super hard as I captured a lot of uh, money, bringing it all the way down so I can just get till people are just fucking destroyed. And then they would be accumulating even more. And then that's when you're going to see that huge ramp up. Um, because I mean, it doesn't take a lot of money. I mean, if we just looked at what the, how much money Apple and all those companies, I mean, let's look at, let's look at the latest news. Um, stock market crash wipes out. Um, let's see. I think I said, saw somewhere roughly around $500 billion. Um, I don't know the exact amount, but uh, how much has been lost? Let's see if AI will bring it up. Down at 600 points. Uh, I need a, everything's paywalled now. Yeah, I think it was like like 500 bill. Uh, here we go. No, this is not it. But like somewhere around, I think I read 500 billion dollars. And so, um, you know. If you can keep dumping 
and uh, you know, shorting the market and make money on the way down while accumulating even more uh, on the way down and then drive that market even higher so that uh, you, know, you make all that money, why wouldn't you? Uh, because that's what the big money would do. Um, but yeah, I definitely see it. I could see it going down like, I mean, I don't know the heat maps of all of them. Um, what is it like short and long position at BTC? I wonder if, I think there's a, like a heat map, map chart. Is this it? I, I remember ha having all of these bookmarked and all that stuff. Now I don't even really pay attention to it. Um, yeah, I don't even know how, I forget. Like it, it was like um, wrecked uh, liquidation chart, liquidation chart, BTC. Oh, there, maybe this one. Liquidation map. So, um, yeah, so like big, big shorts would be like, like if you got 50,000, if you shot it up to 50, what is it, 56,000 to be almost 100,000, 60,000 in shorts liquidated versus only like if it dropped down a few hundred thousand. Or sorry, drop down uh, to fifty-two thousand. Only sixty thousand would be short. I don't know. I mean, I think if it if it dropped down to like, yeah, I don't know. It, it there's just here we go. No, it's still not as good. Yeah. Anyways, I think that um, the market's still gonna be bloody. Um, I like I said, I I. I wrote this article on May of uh, this year. I said that this is, it just seems different. It doesn't feel the same sentiment. And again, I am right. Uh, just like I've been right about this project down, what is it? 35% in seven days and it's going even lower. Um, I mean, it's been just, this is the typical, you know, crypto, uh, market down 90%. So, uh, I mean, it just, uh, I will say that in the grand scheme of things, that BTC and Ethereum will probably be the reigning champions and Seoul because of it's VC funded. And I wouldn't really invest in any other crypto um, because ultimately the reason why crypto is uh, an asset class is because it can be leveraged, borrowed against to reinvest into other asset classes, just like stocks with margin loans, just like real estate with um, cash out refinances, just like businesses with uh, lines of credit. These are all cl asset classes that you can borrow against. And if you don't know that you can about leverage and you know, all that, then you don't understand how money works. So that's it guys, I'm out of here. I just wanted to give you an update on my crypto, what I've been doing, and that I haven't been affected at all. I've actually made good choices because I had sediment in what, just that gut feeling, you know, like it just didn't, I've been in the last couple bull runs and it just didn't feel the same. And I got up and it's paid off. So I'll probably enter back in pretty soon, probably in the next, I wanna say, probably after the election. I think that it, going into election, we'll, we'll definitely be seeing some blood in the water. Um, and so if I can get in at 40,000, I would say between 40 and 50,000, then I'm, I'm golden. So that's it guys, remember to like and subscribe if you want, or you don't, I'm out, peace.